Hi there everybody, this is Fast Trasman with a Trasman Tries. Today we are looking at Citizens, which is part of the current Steam Next Fest, a celebration of upcoming games, which is running from the October the 1st to October the 7th. So depending on the point of when I actually release this, I'm recording this on the 2nd of October, the Saturday, so depending on what time I actually release this, the festival might be over. But anyway... This is part of the Steam Next Fest, which is really, really good. So what is Citizens? Citizens is a blend between turn-based city builder and, and a puzzler for strategy masterminds. Build a thriving settlement, extract and process resources and manage your population by catering to their needs, thus allowing you to build bigger and better. Now this is current, it's made by Red Car Limited, uh, the developer, <coughs> and it's due for release in December 21, 2021 rather. All right, so let's, I've had a little bit of a play with it, so let's just dive in. Okay, let's wait for it to load up. <coughs> Introduction of buildings and men. Oh, okay. Welcome to, Citizen, welcome to Citizens. Your goal is to complete a set of objectives in a designated number of turns. Click me and we'll, we'll quickly talk you through it. You, <coughs> you can see the objectives you need to complete here. You can click on the panel to hide it. Click to continue. This, the current turn is visible on the left of the sun. Turn limit for this level is shown on the right of the sun. Okay, so we've got, we've turned one and we've got 30 turns to do it. Okay, your resources are displayed here. You can open and close them just like the objectives. Okay, enough talking. To be able to build on an island, you need to put down a town hall. Try not to draw too many resources while you're at it. Place it. Placing any building takes one turn. Oh. Okay, so our objective is quite and put a town hall. We can't see the rest of them, so we've got, okay. Building menu, town hall. Where can we put it? It's not going to destroy anything. So basically, some of it's going to get trash, whatever we do. We put it here. Now, can we? Now, hover over a spot you'd like to place your town hall and click. Notice that when hovering over resources, they are highlighted in red. This means that they will be, that they will be destroyed the moment you place a building. So that basically, we can't put it anywhere without destroying something. Okay. Can we rotate? Yes, we can rotate the building. Using Q and E. Which way do we want it facing? Which is the front of the town hall. We've got this way, shall we? Yes, so we can't. So if we go it here, we're only going to... If we put it here, we're only going to lose the trees. We've got a lot of trees. So let's put it here. There we go. Town hall's been placed. Now we need to gather some wood and stone. Build a stone cutter and a stone mason and place them somewhere on the island where they will gather resources more the more resources around them the better click me and i'll get the blueprints for you by the way you can rotate i've already discovered this one <coughs> and rotate the camera using the middle mouse wheel yeah oh, cool cool so that gives us i'm assuming that choose raw materials i'm assuming that's the number of deer we get okay so so we're gonna get that 50 50 50 50 okay so Let's start off with gathering stone. So if we put it here, so that if we put it, so we put it, we just lose all three. If we put it, if we put it here, we'll lose one, but we gather from two. Okay, let's rotate him. I'm not sure there's any way we can get this place without destroying something. Because if we put him here, he's only covering three anyway. But could we put him here? Because we don't, it's like we're not sure of the trees, are we? Yeah, let's just put him in the middle here. Cool, he's done. You'll notice that your your production builders won't produce anything until you have some workers in place. Each house provides one worker. Click me, and I'll fetch you the house blueprint for you. To, for, you for you, build a few houses. Remember these these don't have to be within range of the workplace. That's a relief. Okay, let's click you. House blueprint. So one house gives you one worker so we need we already know we need two workers because we need one for so we put two houses down so we want to put we want to we put them on the town hall don't we we want to about town can we scroll in a minute we can't let's put you just there so just that's that town hall and I'll put one next to it notice how each time you put down a house a turn goes by and resources are gathered careful resources are limited you can be and can be depleted when your workers are hungry they don't pay you tax Okay, so that's obviously how much money we've got. So gold, we've got we're losing gold. Okay, so <coughs> those are do, do do okay. So now, so we've now got a workers' house. If I now go to this, we need to put wood down. So where can I put this? 
Where can I put this? It's going to gather the most resources. Let me put it. We want only. I only want to lose one set of trees. Cool. Oh, okay. You have no food. Okay. This is your balance. Your balance display. Buildings cost maintenance, <coughs> which can which you can cover by building hazards and feeding your people. If you click on the workers' house, you can see what they eat. Workers eat fish, fruit, and meat. Builders build a hunter's hut and get them hunting meat, and they'll start paying you gold. There we go. Look. Okay. Cool. Let us build a hunter's. We have no food. We shall change that. To, no, so where can I put you? And then I'll gather that there. I tried to put you there actually. Can I put you there and catch that lot? Cool. You can skip days, turns, by click on, on the sun icon. Keep clicking on it until you fulfill your objective or click on the menu button and restart if something doesn't go according to plan. Later on, experiment with the building panels with building panels a, a little. You can pause production when resources are being overused or destroy the building or destroy the buildings you don't want anymore. With building panels. Okay, I'm not sure. I'm, I'm not sure means that. They must mean that lot. Okay. Next day, we need another house. Silly, silly me. And what happens if you don't? What happens if you don't feed your population? Uh, maybe I take this one. That's not it. Q and A. Where's the door? I want the door in the right Does it matter? Does it matter? We'll find out, won't we? Ah, that's annoying. Wrong way. Oh well. Okay, so let's see. Let's go. Let's see. We need. We need. So. We need 10 gold, but we need also need. Uh, six, uh, six workers' houses. Okay. Because I don't want to destroy. A house. Let's have a let's have a let's have on the beach. I mean, this is a fairly simple level. I think he says. Cool. Level finished. Next level or play on. Let's go to the next level. Okay. That was fairly simple. I've played. I've. I've, I've already played the first. Well, the first two levels to get out, to get a feel for it. Chapter two of workers and resources. I've just put my tea on my desk, which whenever I put a drink on my desk, I inevitably spill it, but I keep doing it. Okay. We'll do what we do now. If we need a woodcutter, so we need we need to place a town hall where we're not going to lose too much. We can't squeeze it. So essentially, it forces you to lose a tile somewhere. So we put it right on the outskirts, like here. Let's rotate it so it's facing that way, other way, that way. So you can't, from what I can gather, you can't place it without losing a tile. Right, let's spin my map around. That's this way around. Okay, so now where we're at now we want we want wood. So let's get a wood let's get a let's place a wood cut down. Well that's useful. I can put you there and not lose anything. Have I just completely said told you the wrong thing then? So if I put you there that's nice to know. Let's get a couple of work we need two workers' houses, don't we? We need two we need two workers' houses. Let's put you over here by the town hall. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Let's have a... Oh no, come on. I keep pressing the one button here. Do you want to give him a sea view? Yeah, go on. One. Two. We click that one. Now, they're a bit off centre, but it doesn't matter. Next, we now... What we need, we're going to need to feed them, obviously. So can we put them where we can get most out of it? It looks like we can put them there. Uh, can, so let's rotate you. To there. Oh, hang on, I can get all three then, can't I? So you've got, you've got an area of circumference, an area of effect, and when they go green, that's how many you're getting. So we can get that lot. And finally, let's throw the stone merchant, stone person down. Can I get all three in here? So we'll sacrifice one. So I'm going to rotate your sea face in the right way. It's, just, it's, quest, it's trying to get it so you destroy as little resources as possible. There we go. Alright, so that should, so we now should get them going. So now, if I just go. Let's click through. You're out of food. So what we like for food. So and now I need to destroy you and then move you so you are over here. But we should complete this before we run out of food. I have got no doubt when you do run out of food. They stop paying taxes, but that doesn't seem to be a problem really. 
I reckon the early, the early, I think the early levels are just kind of like get you used to the game late levels. Cool. <clears throat> oh, we've got yeah, we've got absolute stacks of food. I don't know why I did that. We've got I just should have checked my resource. We've got buckets of food, not buckets. We've got a lot of food basically. And it's now just clicking through until we get to when well, we've done it. So let's next level. Let's go to the next level, shall we? Of food and income, chapter two. So we've got 20 food, so they want 50, 75 fruit. Ew. Okay. They want 15. This is a this is a bigger challenge, this one is. Right, so let's get the old town all down first. We can't we can put it on the beach. Shall we have a, a seaside down all? Let's get it so I can try and place it so I don't lose anything map space. It's sincerely pointless to lose resource when you don't need to. Stick him in the corner there. Right now what? So we can go oh we can an orchard. And we've got fifty turns to do this. Alright, okay. So if I put this out only one turn, so where do I, where do orchards go? So orchards are gonna take up a space in it. Must be built on grass. And it uses 20 wood, so well, we need 75 fruit. Let's put you. I'm trying to think where I've got where, where I don't mind losing something. Uh, let's put you. Let's put you up here because you're gonna you're gonna be on that. And if I put you there, this happens if I do that. So you need a worker. So we now need to put some. We now need to get some workers houses. So if I oh, can, oh, I'm on the beach, let's just wear some beach, should we put some beach shorts? <laughs> oh, excellent one. Two. Three. That's three for the time being, because then what I then need to do, we need to put some wood down. Right. At the moment, it's not as just a stone at the moment, so I'm a little bit kind of holding off on that, because we don't need stone. We need to put some wood down. So where can I get them? Where's the most we can catch with the wood? If I put you there, you're going to get that. So let's turn it around a little bit. Spin you around. So hopefully I've got the front putting forwards. We need food. If I put you there, you're going to get... I'm trying to see where's, where's the biggest... There's some up here. So if I get you lot there. Okay, let's say you place. So now I've got... How many workers do we need now? So we've got three workers. What? What's your problem? Uh, I'm not sure what the issue is on this one. Uh, woodcutter. Hmm. What have I done wrong here? Okay. So I wonder if. Let's destroy this because I think that I think I know what the problem is. I was wondering how how are they going to get from there up to there? Because it said houses didn't need had the houses didn't need to be near production. However, I'm wondering whether they have to be. Well, they, I'm wondering whether the game lied to me there. Because if I put this here now, nah, because it said it didn't matter where they were, so I put them on the beach. Because that's what it said on the previous one. Uh, we have no food. Hmm. Let's restart. Let's reset this level, shall we? Because I think I made a bit of a mess of that. So let's 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 reset that. Because we, I must have done something wrong. Of food and income. Let's try this one again, shall we? Let's try this one again. Because it said in the it said that house isn't going anywhere. So let's let's do what we said down. Let's stick the town all over here. Let's stick the town all over here. Okay. Now let's now put down a let's put down a hunting place. Put the lodge for food. Put you in the middle there. Let's then put down a house on this same level. 
I want, I'm wondering I'm wondering whether I'm wondering whether you need to have a house on every level. I wonder if like I'm just wondering whether so that's populated on that level. Alright. Let's try a bit of an experiment. Let's now let us now we've got one worker. Let us I wonder if the workers got to be on the same level. I'm just gonna be thinking that as anyway. Alright, let me just do let's try the orchard. Let's put the orchard up here. Let's put the orchard up top here. There. The orchard up there. Let's put a house down here and see if that gets populated with the worker. Or does it need to be popular? Single so that is. Fruit trees, upkeep. Does that need a work does that need a worker though? I'm assuming it does. Let's put one down and see what happens. Fruit trees. And I've got to put an orchard next to the fruit trees. Okay. Ah right, so you need the right, okay, so you need the orchard and the fruit trees. You've exhausted your food supply already. You've got six I've to put you there. Can I squeeze I'm trying to think I can squeeze without losing anything. Let's go this way. So I'm wondering whether now if I put you there how the house has got to be on the same level. Does then that then mean that if I so if I now destroy you, let's build a house up there behind him. Uh, required workers house you've got no right, let's, turn, let's try another experiment as we learn what this game actually does this is going to cost double, if I put that down there like that don't want to fit costs, right, so we can't afford that at the moment, right so let's destroy you let's build another house down here, this is it complicated isn't it Put a house down there. Let's put another. Let's put an orchard in the space we've just created. Let's put an orchard in the space we've just created. We are going to need wood, woodcuts down. So first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to put a woodcut down. I'm going to put the woodcutter just. Where can I put you? Uh, can I put you somewhere I'm not going to lose lose anything? Let's put that down there. Uh, I'm somewhat confused now because he's saying you've got any workers, but you got, and I don't understand this at all. Uh, okay, so let's just go to day two. If I put down another worker, what happens then? Another worker's house. Hmm. So what's your problem? Uh, minus one worker, but I've got workers over here. You've you've got to work. You take four workers. Oh, and it doesn't matter what level you want. I didn't know that. You take four workers. That's bonkers crazy. Right, we haven't got enough wood, so let's pause you a second. Let's get you paused. Are you gonna then? Are you not gonna come down from there? So I'm gonna have to destroy you, aren't I? That's a bit of a pain, isn't it? So now I've got four workers, so right, that makes sense, kind of. This is a bit more complicated, isn't it? I, I, right, okay, I didn't pay attention to that one, did I? Every day's a school day. Let's put some more houses down here. Okay. Right, so we need some more. Let's kick over some more wood. And if you pause it, it doesn't stop production. It doesn't stop the build. From, it doesn't do anything in terms of. All right, okay, so we still need the fruit. We have no food. Okay, so let's now. We don't have enough wood for food, so we're going to have to get hungry for a bit. This is. 
listen, this is absolutely fact. This has really got me. This is kind of like really surprised me. How much? How, how much? How, how much more complex it actually is? Which, like, I'm halfway through, and we're nowhere near producing what we need to produce. So, if I put an orchard down here, right? I'll leave that up there. So that's not doing out. Okay. If I had to put an orchard down here, and we go another move. How much do you take to build? You take 10 to build. No, that's not what I wanted to do. No, you take 20 to build. Okay. You're going to run out of trees soon enough. You've run out of deer, so we'll destroy you. And then I shall move you up to here. I'll get you up there. You're going to get. Yeah, put you up there. I'll get you working up there. If we go hit next turn, let's destroy you. Let's put you now. Nope, 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 nope. Let's put you kind of. Can I put you there? Okay. Right, let's gonna go to food. You need 10 wood, so yeah, this is like. This is a lot more complicated than it looks. I didn't. I've not given this game the near as near as near enough respect as it deserves. This is a, there's a lot more to this. You've now got you've now got enough food over there. Yeah, I this we might be resetting this again. Let's get an orchard down. If I kind of put you there, I can then get another orchard. Or you can get another orchard there. Can't squeeze one there. Can we squeeze another orchard in there? Okay. Right. You're doing that. So we need to get another hunter's hut, which we've got. We've got enough of it time being. So we've got. So we've got. We're going to have. We've got. There's. There's one in there. There's four in. That's five. So if we need five. So we need another hunter's. We ain't got enough for that, have we? Oh, we do okay let's put him there we haven't got enough for it so let's just take the next turn you need 20 wood okay let's pop you there like that okay right then so we've got one spare person so we need to get the houses down so let's build we need 10 wood for that wood cord okay this is this is a lot more complicated than it looks we're going to be resetting this level again now oh, this is fantastic i oh, this is yeah it's this is a puzzle element you've got to get the balance between harvesting the wood and the deers for food while going the orchard at the same time you can't do one or the other because you eventually run out of food so what i yes so what you've got to do, you've got to balance off collecting the collecting them, getting the food to feed them, getting the wood to, to build everything, while at the same time growing your orchards. Okay. Because we haven't got enough wood to Yeah, that's getting us four. So that's we've now got used all that wood. Right, and we've still got 75 bows, 75 of them to go. So if I'm now gonna go and build another orchard up here another one up here because you can't extend the range for these two can you that'll get that pair let's destroy you because you're now done let's go to here let's get another orchard down here because you will be picked by you okay we need 20 wood for that so let's just go yeah we're going to reset in fact i'm going to let's let's see what let's go to the end see what happens we need to get don't do it next day next level failed that is fantastic i get it. oh that's just it looks so simple but it's actually not that simple at all it's really really there's a real complex order in which way you have to do things that is fantastic oh, that's just like it's blowing my mind a little bit that blowing my mind a little bit it's so deceptively simple let's try this again right i'm gonna stick my town all over here okay I don't, I'm not sure why you have to have the town on first, but I'm not sure to sure what the town actually does, to be quite honest with you. What does it do? I don't know, just, you just got to have one, I suppose. Right, so, 
we've got to each that cost 10 that costs that's 30 and that costs so that's 30 50 and that needs five houses and that then each house costs 10 so we can effectively build we can build one deer one yes yeah, is right let's build let's build the wood first let's build the wood first let's build the woodcutters first because the woodcutters will expect space for the f I'm actually going to put it on here because we don't need we don't need this I'm going to put that we're not we're not required to build we're not required to build let's build houses on the beach as well let's give people beach huts they look great what are you on about no what are you going to say it won't they look fantastic there we go all right all right so ne then let's next get down somewhere to catch the deer that's another one of those put another house down on the beach B beach hut living there that's two okay all right they'll get their food in all right okay all right, let's hit next turn okay <laughs> Oh, okay what do I want to do next hmm let's put another let's put another deer ranch down here because we we're not we're not tasked with actually I'm not because my thought process is this will clear those two trees so let's not so that's cleared that so what I can do now is I am gonna destroy you I'm gonna build you but you're going to require four people so if i put you kind of in the middle if i know i'm not i'm going to wait for these to be done let's put another let's put another lumber camp down it's it's a real there's a real balancing act here to get let's get that down there's a real balancing act here to try and make sure that you are there's a real balancing act to make sure that you're not going to use all the supplies before you get the production in before you get enough fruit let's roll to the next day on that one we lo we're using each house uses six food i think if I, so we should use six food again right okay so am i going to clear this in before we no we're not that's a blow i was hoping i could clear that so i need to get this down before I do anything you can fit on the beach which is fine okay great right okay so you clear that so let's now delete you i can now put you down because you're going to fit kind of there if i put you kind of in the middle there and then i can get one orchard there and I can, if I can rotate you, I can get one orchard there. Okay. Right. You are now got nice. Let's destroy you. So you've got four workers. You've got one. So we've got six people and we've got one spare. Okay. Let's create. Let's have a look what we like for food. Let's get and let's get let's get the deer hunter back in and get him to just to polish that lot off there. Okay. And I'm going to put that there because let's just rotate it because we're not bothered. One of the requests isn't to get stone. We don't need stone to build anything. All right, okay, so that's working. Away. So each field gives two berries, two fruits. All right. So now we've got no spare people. We're still going to get. Some, so we've got plate we've got wood so let's, let's not go crazy with our wood so you are now out of wood you've got one left wood to get so let's just hit next turn you're out of trees so let's now delete you and let's go over here and let's move you to there there's i can't get you to catch everything but you'll do so you can get a chop in there okay you're out of deer so let's delete you and let's get you up here to here right let's build can i squeeze another orchard in up there i don't think i can i don't think i can if i put you there will you can't if i put you there i wonder 
I don't think you will. I don't think I will. I've not, I've not got my place on that very well, have I really? I have not. Simple like that's that's, that's going to use four more people. So if I put one there, okay. Let's move you. So you are. If I kind of put you there like that, like that. So I take you. I'm see if I can get. Okay, so that's that. So you need more people. So let's get some more houses down. Right, let's just get wood going for the time being. Okay, let's get let's now get some wood down. That's not wood. Yeah, that's nice houses we need. So we need two more people. I think so. That's two, four, eight, ten, four, eight, nine, ten. So we need four more houses. So let's get our beach hook community going on. Everybody's on the beach now. Wrong with that? Last little beach sea, sea views. Okay. Okay. That's now we need to we need that producing we need to get some wood going on. So if I hit that there, let's we're gonna get wood back from you. Keep an eye on food. So we need to re, we need to put another food down. So I'm gonna put you up here because there's a stack of food up here. Okay. Uh, let's hit the next date again. Let's get some more. Let's get some more fruits down because we're nearly at the we're nearly we do not I can get more of them down I can get another one there can't I oh, what's wrong with you there oh not enough water okay not enough water okay you are out of trees aren't you so we could I could have hit a stumbling bucket because that could be a bit of a problem right so how much does a lumber camp cost to build got to find I can build one stick you that way there Okay, you're there, so we're not gonna do this again. We need I need five houses which need five houses needs Okay let me think so if I build a house a house costs ten we're not gonna do this because I need I need fifty or oh, we might do This is going to be really tight. Let's destroy you. Now right, let's see if I can build five houses now. For let's last nice trip them up. Level failed. Ah. Every house costs a turn. Ah, oh, I didn't think that through, did I? Oh, gutted. Oh, no. That's a great, I love this game. It's a puzzle to put a city builder at the same time. That's fantastic. Anyway, this is, this is, this is being a little look at citizens. The demo is, like I said, the demo at point of recording is available in Steam. Hope, I don't I, I don't know whether it's a limited time demo or whether it's going to be up there until release. I don't know. But go on, go and check it out. It's I love this. It's fantastic. The first two levels don't really give you a, a clue of the depth. It's a it's a balancing act between making sure that you've got to produce everything alongside each other. You can't just go get all my wood, get all my food, because as you're building, your people are eating the food. It's a real balancing act. That was, I love that, we were one turn away. You see, you really can't afford to miss turns in producing things. But anyway, I hope you've enjoyed that little look at Citizens. I think it's fantastic. Anyway, thanks very much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe on your way out, and that would be a great help. And I'll see you in the next one. All right then, cheers, bye.